Hi, this is a Geo Tracker 94, and I want to put a uh, car starter in here. Underneath the uh, steering column, this is the piece that's in here. This connector here on the right side goes to the ignition switch. This this half here to the switch, this half to the vehicle. This white with the green stripe, I think, is hot from the battery. And I'll demonstrate all the stuff in a couple minutes. Uh, actually, seconds too. Okay, does that mean okay? Okay, good. <clears throat> okay, this is a test light. Let's see if I can widen the view for you. This is a beefy wire. You just can't stick it in there. You see it? You see it, right? Look up. Yeah. Now, on the top half of this, it's on the top, this thing's. Why is it just so stiff and tight? Let me show you on the top. This is light for me too. This this blue one on the top here on the end, is it just blue? I guess it's solid blue. I'm gonna probe that. You won't, you won't see me probing the wire, but you'll see the light. that right through the insulation if I can. Dang it. It's not really that cold out here today. This is Thursday before Christmas. Let's see if I can get this done Christmas. There we go. See how the it comes on. Now this is accessory position so the radio works. Now I turn it on on, so that's accessory, that's on, engine on, turn that down, I hear the engine blower running also, there the blower's off, I'll turn the radio down so you can hear that, little radio, blower, when you crank, it goes off, that's important because you don't want anything drawing power off the starter, that might be heavy, so blue is accessory, and what I say, okay, the, the yellow black, yellow with a black stripe here. That should be enough bite. Okay, here's accessory again. Radio time to warm up. Seems light, right? See how light light up? We are. Yeah. Now, on position, it lights. Okay, so this is accessory two because my crank again it goes off, so that's not a ignition line. Okay. Now the a red and black here. I'll stick that. Red with black stripe, black with red stripe. It's not on accessory, not on on, but it's on with crank. That's the crank, that's the starter. Now I'm looking one that stays on while it's cranking. That will be the true ignition wire. One of these tiny ones. It's this wire. I don't, I don't think it's it's gonna be a tiny of a wire. What do you got? We got a purple up here. Uh, yeah, oops. Come on. You know, it helps when you can see. Light on? Yeah, light's still on. I, I just can't probe this wire. I'm not hitting it, and that's not it either. Oh, wait, it's the horn? The horn, I think, grounds to crank below. Oh, there's a big black wire here. This is the black with a stripe. Let's see. 
Ooh, okay, there's why it's on, on, on. And it's on the crank. It's not on the accessory. That would have to be our ignition. I guess next to the blue on the top. Let me get that camera up in here. Okay, so. All in all, we got the wires we need for this thing to work, which is the second wire on the top from this end, which is ignition. Uh, this blue wire here, which is accessory. And I think they might maybe call it ignition too. But it shuts off when you're cranking, so that's like that's like the blower and reverse lights. And I think wipers maybe. And then there's a small maybe it's a brown stripe or a red stripe. One on the bottom, that's the crank wire. And here is a jumble of stuff. Model. Remote starter. This is an oldie. I've had it for like years, never put it in. Here we go. 24727. And we're going to try to get this thing working today. Here we go. This is what we got at the moment. I added the uh, horn and the parking lights, and now we're. So, Miss Claus and I were heading out to Carver's Auto Parts and get some uh, some more parts, ring lugs, and maybe a hood switch, which we supposed to have. But I can make it work with that. And Wendy's fries. And Wendy's fries. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> we got three dollar gas here. Two ninety nine point <laughs> nine. Addy, regular cash. Crazy. Okay, guys, you are not going to believe this. Guess what my husband's got. Look, it's Coke Zero. High octane, you slob. <laughs> and guess what? I get stuck with them. <laughs> Have a nice day. Okay. Oh, you're sitting. Shall we? <laughs> okay, finished off on this uh, car starter. Okay. I gave you the list of the wires on that side. Over here, tapped in, we got this wire, which color is yellow. Okay, this is the lights. This is the parking lights. If you look at this connector, this is the way this one is. With this tab on the bottom down here, this wire is red. We're tapped into. Right next to, it's right next to, right next to that there white wire with a brown stripe on it, brown dots. That's our parking light wire. Okay. And even harder to get at. Down here, I think it's another red wire, to be honest with you. How do I get that in here? See what the green tape is? That's what I'm trying to get at. Oh, the blue. I think it's that first blue. See that blue right there? Facing this direction? That is the horn. If you use a uh, if you use a, a light, one of those light probe things, um, just the light current will blow, will blow the horn. Close the relay and blow the horn, so. And that, that allows us to blow the horn from the key switch, which is actually the door lock option. Do you see this? Yeah, here it is. This is the start and this is the light. The light, you push it and hold it, and it stays on. I don't know if it stays on definitely to hit it again. But turning it, hitting it again, will shut it off. And that's about it. And it also works good. This valet switch, supposedly it's running. Your foot is on the brake, I think. No, your foot's not on the brake. It's just running. You turn this off, on, off, on. Then you can take the key out and keep it running. Lock the doors, go in and get your coffee. We've got to test that yet.